Holla back, youngins. It's Jordan. And Wesley. Guess who's back? Well, I guess you don't have to guess because he just said it's here. But Wesley's here. Your I know. Mom is back. <laughs> She's making me do chores. Anyways, yeah, you've been, you had a lot of work recently. So that's oh, what. I'm, I got a lot of work coming up. Also, for the people who are here who, you know, watch League videos, we haven't been posting them because we haven't been able to record with, uh, I guess, the updated Rift. Is that what's been going on? You just haven't been able to record with Low yeah, Replay? Yeah, Low Replay doesn't record anything. So anyways, but let me get into the gameplay real quick because this is some crazy gameplay. So basically, I'm running with like a full team here, but they're not like... <laughs> no, they're running for the yeah, nasty. Um... Day nasty, 726 sluts. <laughs> <laughs> anyways, yeah, I'm running a... Uh, with like a mostly full team, but it's kind of the perfect setup because if you run with a full team and they're all slayers, you know, like really good players, um, you're not going to have a fun time, you know, because you'll, you'll just cap everything. Everybody's going to be dead. You're running around looking for enemies, you know. It's the kind of game where you like end up like 17-2 and two and you're like wondering what happened. But this game, I, I was playing with these guys. They randomly added me and then, you know, I joined their clan or whatever. They seem like cool guys. Uh, so if you, if you guys are watching this, props to you guys, and this was really fun playing with them. But anyways, it was a 22 gun streak, or 21 I think maybe, sniping. And I have not been doing much besides sniping, but I've never gotten a streak like that just sniping. It's all gun streak, and it, I missed some shots, but it gets pretty insane, and I was super psyched when I got it. I guess you could call it a nuclear fail or whatever it's called in this game, but I was just so excited when I got past 15, because I haven't even gotten a 15 gun streak in this game yet. Um... So yeah, that's the gameplay. I'm not going to talk about it that much. Because we had some other stuff to talk about. And why waste our, your time and everybody's time when we actually have a real live commentator here. What, I don't yes, know what you must listen to what I say. Because what <laughs> I say is the truth. And you will take the truth like it's the only truth. Truth? <laughs> Okay, so what are we talking about today? It's a good question. Oh yeah, first of all, well, the first thing I want to talk about is it is Thanksgiving tomorrow. Well, actually, it's one thirteen, so it's Thanksgiving today. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Uh, so I wanted to start off kind of talking about not everything I'm thankful for. I didn't want to do a kind of cliche commentary because, you know, who, who actually talks about Thanksgiving on Thanksgiving? But I just wanted to bas basically say to you guys, thank you so much for 82 subs. Um, no, I don't thank you guys because that's cliche. You don't thank the subscriber. You you talk shit. You're like, hey, subscribers. I know why you subscribe. Because you, you pity us. You're like, oh, these guys <laughs> only have 50 subscribers. It's so sad. I'll subscribe just to watch one of their videos and leave half of a like. And be like, okay, I, I helped them out. No, no. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> this is Thanksgiving. You literally just told our subscribers you know what to happens, fuck know what happens tomorrow? What happens tomorrow? People don't give a shit about thinking. They just buy whatever fuck they want and be mean to everybody <laughs> else. Yeah, man. Wesley is working. What, what are your shifts again? You got some crazy I got, work schedules. Tomorrow, I got to work Thanksgiving night uh, from 8 to 12. Midnight to midnight. Uh, oh, God. That's not bad, but I get paid double. But then Black Friday, I got to work 9 hours from 3 o'clock to midnight. Very next morning, I gotta come in at nine in the morning and do shit, and clean up, and do six another six hours at least, and then I gotta come in on Sunday after that. I don't know how long I'm working there, and I'm pretty sure I'm working on Monday as well because I always work Monday because nobody likes to work Mondays. It's fuck Mondays, so yeah, that's like five days in a row. So lots of bank, except I gotta pay tuition, I gotta pay insurance, I gotta pay for my Xbox, I gotta buy my cat. <laughs> so, um, buy a cat. So, yeah, it's gonna be a uh, uh, tiring next few days. But we're already halfway through the game today. Shit, we we're supposed to talk about some interesting topic here. We're, we're gonna talk about dating, but don't, don't quote. I mean, well, actually, quote me because I'm saying it, but <laughs> don't take what you hear. From us and apply it in real life. Don't try this at home, kids. It might not work. You might end up in jail. <laughs> yeah. All right. So Jordan, first, do you want to talk about your dating experience? Because well, first, obviously you have way more experience than I do. Well, as I always like to start dating commentaries, because we've talked about girls in a few commentaries, and we really should come up with a name for this series. If you guys have any suggestions, leave them in the comments below. Um, talk shit. About and as always, you know, like suggest stuff if you like it, if you like this kind of stuff. But whatever, I always kind of like ramble on about that stuff. I always like to start girl commentaries by talking about Wesley's love life and uh, 
Who I'll, would you say? I will talk about my of, old love. Of all no, of the no, <laughs> no. of all of the girls you've dated, which one is Wait, most likely? What do you mean like dated? Like going out? That doesn't count though. Like no, dated of, is like official. Like, of, oh yeah, of all of your girlfriends. Well, I never had any official. Like it was like it was like an eh, like eh, okay, and but all, of all of those, which one is most likely to grow up to do crystal meth? That single one. That single one. Exactly. <laughs> I just I love I love doing that. Anyways, uh, my dating life. Um. So I'm actually on really good terms with my uh, ex-girlfriend. Not on good terms. Like, she's one of my best friends. We talk a lot. Um, French zone. Because she's in France. Oh, I see what you did there. Yeah, she's in she's in Paris. So shout out to you, Catherine, if you're watching this. She was watching our commentary on uh, Kindergarten Romance. She's like, oh, I was not in that. And I was like, it's kindergarten. <laughs> you want to go back into my past and be in kindergarten? Fine, I'll put you in the commentary. But, um, yeah, so... I don't know. Any? Do you have specific questions or just uh, experiences? About one of the dates in high school. You go on a date with in high school. Your high school dates. High school dates. Uh. All right. Well, actually, yes. Here, I'll talk about Catherine because she was like she's like my first. Well, I mean, I've had kind of two kind of serious girlfriends, but she was much more serious than Alex, who I went out with uh, oh, I sophomore year. Name. Well, how do you know? Now they know it's a real name. No, See, they would have thought it was a fake name. Well, guess what? Alex is a dude. Yeah, exactly. You're on to me. And a mom. All right. And a mom. And, and what else? a dude and a mom. Yeah. All right. So we're we're fucking six and a half minutes, and we don't know what the fuck we're talking about. Anyways, so I don't know. Dating tips, dating advice. I, like honestly, if you have questions about this kind of stuff, really leave comments because that would uh, really help us structure stuff more. And ask me. Yeah, ask Wesley. I mean, if you're looking for the kind of response that's gonna get you slapped, you know who to come to. Doctor Love. When people slap you, they're opened up to you because they actually listen to what you said. So, first dates. <laughs> uh, I remember, actually, we met at a party. And, um, yeah, we kind of hit things off there. And then I looked her up on Facebook because <laughs> she went to my school, but I didn't know her. And she was, like, a grade below me. And we had already graduated. This was in the summer, so I had graduated at least. She's a year below me. She was a senior. So I looked her up on Facebook. I was like, hey, you know, if, you know, if last night was just like a one-time kind of thing, that's cool. But if you would be interested in, you know, hanging out or something, you know, that'd be, I, I wasn't that smooth. I, you know, whatever. I said something on Facebook. And she responded. She's like, yeah, you know, last night I was, didn't, I kind of thought it would be a one-night thing, but you know, I wouldn't mind hanging out again. And now I'm, I'm, I'm going to make fun of her for saying that. Next time I, next time I talk to her, it'll probably be like tomorrow, I, I will just say, I will just remind her of that. But, so I took her out to like a Thai restaurant. And it was cool, and um, yeah, and then from there, you know, things heated up. We uh, we it actually really heated up because it was yeah. during the summer. We have actually how many abortions do we have now? Like Fourteen. <laughs> All right, we're we're done with me. You want to move on to you? Well, I um, I hate to say this, but uh, I don't really have any official dates because, first of all, I hate girls. <laughs> Like, they don't, like, like, they don't understand me. Like, come on. Like, like, well, actually, the thing is, I kind of experience split personality when I'm around girls. So, like, right now, I'm, the way I'm talking and shit, I don't actually say anything I'm saying for the last five hours. Is it say five hours? Sure. We'll go five hours. In regular life. Like, I'll be out in a restaurant. And I'll be like, yo, um, can I get a juice? <laughs> but then if juice? I'm at Jordan's house, I'll be like, give me that juicy skeet. And then, <laughs> and then, and okay. then be like, okay, what the fuck? And then who are you? No. And then, so that's, that's, that's why. We cut like, you off right that's, there. that's why like, it, it's really difficult for me to, because I, I, I find that for, it's hard for people to accept my true self. Give me that juicy and skeet. Especially. Especially around the girls I like because, you know, from like, the culture, it's like, in Taiwan, it's like, oh, like, like they, they like separate the boys and girls in the swimming team, I mean, swimming class, and sometimes in PE, and then like, it's all about like, oh, you can't talk to girls. I mean, you can't, but it's like, like they, they no, especially, no, no, nobody can see your face. They especially so. like, emphasize the guys should hang out with guys, the girls should hang out with girls. So, it was... Difficult for me to like interact with girls, especially like I'll be like, 
I don't know what to talk about because I I have lots of things to talk about, but I don't I care I think I guess I can say I care too much because like I would care about what they think of me too much and then I would just act hella weird. Like the one time I actually not actually normal to a girl was like Maybe to uh the so and so that I will not mention. Like in high school. One my one time where I actually had a chance to actually get in a some somewhat serious, semi serious, maybe not so much relationship. Oh god. But then I said, hashtag lick your nipple, I dumped that shit. <laughs> Alright. So we're just, we're just gonna cut it off there. If you guys enjoyed this kind of thing, a like would be much appreciated. My mom is just calling every phone in the house, so yeah, anyways, I ended up with only 10 deaths, which is pretty rare. I had no idea I had the score line at the end. But if you guys liked it, leave a like, and I will talk to you guys later, because I gotta leave.